Hi, my name is Adolfo Net, and I'm an associate professor at the Federal University of Technology, Paraná. I'm going to present my three favorite resources for those that want to learn Elixir. So you are seeing the, the web page for the programming language. It's, uh, I, I won't include it in this list because it's the basic place where you go when you, you, you want to learn when you want to learn something about Elixir. So I really like books and I loved this book, Programming Elixir 1.6 by Dave Thomas. It was the first book, the first book from a, a relatively big publishing company like Pragmatic Bookshelf that was written about Elixir. It, when it was written, Elixir was in the 1.0 version, I believe, then it came the version of Programming Elixir 1.3, and now they have the Programming Elixir 1.6. Yes, I know Elixir is now in, in version 1.10, but I still think this book is very useful. People love other books, like the, the uh, one book by Sasha Jurik, but I haven't read it, so that's why I'm including this book. It's important to notice here that this book is free, the, the ebook is free for educational domains. For instance, if you have an address, email address in, in .edu, you can use coupon code to get a free book. If you don't have this email address ending, for instance, my email is .edu.br from Brazil. But I asked them and they included my email address in this list and I got a, a free copy of the book. So here you can even read some, some sample chapters. There is all these the subjects. It's quite comprehensive, 410 pages. When I bought that book, I didn't know that this site existed. It's Elixir School. I think this site is great because also it's also quite comprehensive. A lot of content here, advanced actual like specific libraries. There is even blog posts in English. You can read here. And also, let's go back to Elixir School. It is available in several language, languages, Spanish, Portuguese, my, my mother tongue, Bahasa, Indonesia. I'm not sure if I'm speaking it right, but it's a great resource and it's, uh, you can find the GitHub project for this, this site here. There, there are several contributors where can we find up ah, here insights and contributors don't spark is the main contributor but there are several other contributors thanks to all the people from elixir school it's a great resource and my third favorite book oh sorry my third favorite resource is Telegram lists. Yes, I know people prefer to go to, to other sites, but I really like Telegram because it's, it gives us some serendipity. You, you learn things that you weren't expecting. You don't have to, at least I don't have the fear of missing out when I am on a Telegram group because it's a lot of messages. So if you lose something, forget about it. I have created a Telegram group for alchemists from all over the world, Elixir World, you can find it here. I put the, the link in the description, but there is also, if you can speak Portuguese, there is Elixir Brazil with 1,450 members. I have just found this one from four members of the PUN. I believe Pyun is a region in India. There is also, oh, this one is from Brazil. Let me see. Uh, 
how many members we have right now 158 and there are also other groups if you need the, the links I can I can give you when, uh, if you ask me on Twitter my Twitter is Adolfo NT okay so that's it for this video thank you very much